Hello, and welcome back to part six. Part six of Quantum Conundrum. Uh, in the last episode, we just played Catch With Ourselves, which is uh, science. It's awesome and kind of depressing at the same time, if you, if you think about it. I haven't seen any other forms of life in this place, so... Um, with that, we'll carry on to Is It Safe to Ride? My guess is no, but we're going to do it anyways. Uh, Alright, what do you do? Oh. Apparently this unit also needs a bit of tweaking. Oh. Wait, you need to throw me more? So I, I guess what we do is we... Is we Have a glitch line. dolly. Okay, we wait for a save to come out. Well, let's save start up. It's small. Okay. It's still growing. Okay. Let me just. I'm just gonna let it go. Oh. All right. So there's there's Fluffy. Hello, Fluffy. Put that right there. Oh. Is that word? And so with this one, we. We can't just make a staircase because, uh, in order to actually open the door, we need to. Oh no, wait. Yeah, we can make a staircase. What am I? What am I talking about? I was gonna say we're gonna have to stack them instead of doing this air case type thing that I love to do so much because we can get up there and then turn it off. So we can get up there and then turn it off and then it'll work. There we are. Mike, what's up, yo? Hey, where'd you go? I didn't even hear the normal pop you do when you teleport like that. Of your aptitude to handle this situation. Uh, 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 fuck off. All right, so conveyor belt. Oh, for real, dude, this is so cool. Okay, look. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get right here and toss it. In the middle, kind of straight up -y, and then switch. Is this really? <gasps> this is so cool, man. Oh no. Oh, we can still do it. Oh. Oh. How did that work? All right, one more time. We're gonna try one more time. Oh wait. I think there's. <laughs> I'm doing this the hard way. Okay, so instead, what we're gonna do is, aha! This is this is what this platform's for. We're gonna toss it over to the other side like this, and I'll hop up here, and okay. Well, one more time. We're going to throw it like so, so I can actually get on top of it. And we're just gonna go with the wave, man. Well, that was a pleasant surprise. I like the first way better, actually. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do the awkward noise generator. What are you? So how do you? So what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to sit back here, throw it. Switch to another dimension, super quick. See if I can't. I just don't know how you do it. Ah! What is going on? Oh, we had to make it this time. Yes. Why did I make honk? Bastard. God, that's like ten minutes of my life I'm never getting back. Judging by the fascinating lands of missing items, I can hypothesize that I am officially lost. Short term memory gone. Trapped in some sort of pocket dimension. Today is a good day. It is a good day. Every day is a good day. Way to be positive, man. Okay. Have a book. This used to be one of the manor's libraries. I uh Altered. 
Why would you alter? Ooh, we can look at all these books. Great exponent. Uh, War of the Parallel Jurassic Quark. Who made these? They need to have their own show a ratio. And here's Cam. <laughs> what? That's fantastic. All right. So what this button does is travel safely. All right. So we need to slow down time and see what happens. I have a feeling we need to. Uh, how do you figure this? She's spinning something out. Oh. Aha! Uh -huh. I see. This way up. Don't care. What's that saying? It's like wrangling cats. Don't fall, don't fall! Okay. I really don't want these guys to fall. I don't want to fall. Alright. Excellent. Very synchronized. Oh, I don't get to see what I had this they portrait do in of myself different dimensions. I commissioned before we began time travel in the mid 70s. Time traveling was certainly all the rage back then, at least among the more scientific circles. In One of our 70s? colleagues used to throw the most amazing costume parties, and you know you just can't beat the real thing. He threw costume parties where they actually brought the so, like, you if you were... know that the only legal way to hunt tigers is to travel back in time to do it. Not that I would recommend doing as such. Interestingly enough, I have a hypothesis that the only reason tigers are about to go extinct is because <laughs> people are going back in time and shooting them. So they went and hunted tigers? Wow, I, that's a, uh, bitchy costume. It's very stylish and sporty and all other kinds of good qualities. All right. Where are the puzzles at, yo? The odds are stacked against you. Against you or against me? I made the first prototype when I was your age. I haven't had the heart to change the design. Prototype of what? Uh... There should be an IDS battery on the other side of the fan. So we jump on him. We're gonna have to slow. Oh, okay, we tilted a little bit, so we get a little extra room on this jump. Alright, let's go. Now, oh, hello door. Wildly convenient. Alright, so this is a lot like the uh, other one that we did with the twist. Oh. They go back in time, so the cat's a... like a panther, and whoever that is is a hunter. Oh. Wow, what? Alright. Oh, no. Alright, wait, let's see. I want to get over to that generator, so... Alright, yeah, I think it's exactly like what I did before. In the stairway to heaven, what was it called? Yeah, let's go. Alright, slow bugs. So we want to get that one. We want to do four, then three, then two, then one. And then nothing. Ah! 
No, no. Damn it. Alright, now let's get rolling. I don't think this blazer is able to kill us. Alright, what are you? Monkey? Hello. Having your own personal zoo. Children like zoos, right? Yep. Children love zoos. Alright, so I think we just do the same thing to get across to the actual end here. Yeah, that looks about right. One, two, three. Heavy. One, two. One. Excellent. Alright, now we just... Oh, man. Tickles my innards. Can we jump? Yep. Jump, jump, jump. Oh! Oh, hit my head. Thought I was gonna fall. Mm. Our time travels took us to feudal <laughs> Japan, where they took a rather strong liking to Ike. I hope introducing them to a small, cute, fluffy creature somehow didn't always be <laughs> present. I get it, because ah, they a like... in this painting. You just can't see him. That meme is overused. Um, I don't know, it's not high quality. I'm sad you said that, Quadrangle. I think less of you I know. and I traveled back in time once to find the fabled Lost City of Gold. We never did find it. And to be honest, the Lost Cities of Bronze and Silver really weren't that impressive. <laughs> Could have been worse, I suppose. Could have been worse. You Could have had molten metal down your throat. That would have been exciting. Which is actually how they killed people back then, uh, I think. The natives used to pour molten gold down the conquistadors' mouths? Because they were so obsessed with it? Was the idea? Alright, so... Let's see what's in here. We have heavy and we have... Yeah, we ought to stay out of the way. So I think... Yeah, whenever this is triggered, then they go. So... Keep an eye on that activation. Oh, so we need to open this door? That was a pretty good shot, huh? Alright, so now we can get them through. Oh no. And I guess what we want to happen is they want to be all the way on the other side, so we're gonna stop all these boxes. So he can get through there. What's gonna happen once we? Um, let's make sure. Oh, we need to jump on them in a bit. I think. Yeah. Okay. Should be good. If it's not, I'm gonna be kind of mad. Wait. How do you get up? Wow, that was close. Uh, so I'm gonna hope that he just doesn't drop down. Uh, so he does this. Can we jump on him? Yes. Yes. Okay, we made it. Now, what on earth is up here? A battery? Ike. What is up? 
Why you sad, Ike? Thanks, man. He's going through some stuff right now. So... I don't know what I just did! I, like, jumped off of it and... That was strange. Okay, so... Got that there. And now we just do that standard thing that we do. So I switched to Fluffy, jumped, and grabbed... I don't know how that works, man. Completely blows my mind. There are clouds here. Have I mentioned that? No, you oh, actually haven't. Wait. Wait. Is that lint? Lint clouds? Ugh. No bueno. Alright, moving on. A boost of confidence. Hello, Dolly. Apparently, you feel you don't need an advanced degree in robotics to operate that. Nope. I push buttons all the time. It's the compression platform again. Got it. Alright, so we... You remember that you need a dramatic mass change, right? Huh. Hello, Ike. How is he doing that? He doesn't have a dramatic mass change. Wait, so what's this? Snake. Uh, okay, not gonna make any of those ends. See how I got that one up there. He's always been a fan of the compression platforms. So. Oh, over here. Yeah. All right. Okay. I'm gonna put that guy over there. Made it. Uh. Alright. Excellent. The phone is ringing. Alright. Uh, where are we? I have a feeling we're gonna slow motion this. Oh, alright. 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 Alright, so we put this there. What's that saying about daylight savings time? Derp? Back. Heavy metal? Bring forward. Wait! Oh man. Any second this watch? They're so awesome. All right, heavy. Personally, I think daylight savings is absolutely useless and ludicrous, right? Yes, it is. He's actually extremely right. It's arbitrary as hell. Um. All right, what is? Uh, okay, so we push this, switch to Fluffy, and switch to... Wow. These puzzles are cool. I don't know why. Alright, with that epicness, You've got uh, to be kidding me. Gum? Oh, gum. There's some on my shoe. Alright, Shugum. Uh, yeah, we just got to a save point, um, and that was pretty epic, so, see you tomorrow for part seven. Seven. Seven? Or is it seven, huh? Alright. See ya!